push down, we give them a couple minutes to eat it. They don't eat it. It's yeah, it goes out. The next meal. Yeah. Because five minutes hey, to eat, you have to go yep, back for sure. And you're also toilet training. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we did again. We did that when ours was a puppy. Yeah. So. So it, it's all there three times a day, and then and approximately five to six months of trauma twice a day. Yeah. Okay. Every dog's different. You'll yep. see. He'll stop being yes. interested in yeah, lunch. Yeah. At the lunch time. Yeah. Uh, yeah. There is a few pages on house training. Remember, he had a huge advantage. Whenever he wakes up, he's got to go to the bathroom. Five ten minutes after eating. Five yep. minutes after drinking. Yep. Water stays down. All, all right. the time. Yep. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, okay. Water okay. All, all three. Go all three. Can, right. Nine o'clock. So, so all three. Can, okay. Now they're off. Yeah. 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 And he's sleeping till 6 30, 7 Perfect. o'clock, you know? Yeah, so that's awesome. He may wake up the first couple of nights yeah, we've... because he's not sleeping in his pile of litter. Mix. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So it doesn't matter what he sleeps in, a crate, a dog bed, your bed. I, yeah. you know, look, I don't care. He's got to be in someone's room. Yeah, I'm so he's going to be in Gavin's room. We've got a crate with a nice fluffy bed all set up, and we've got that ready to go. And so if he wakes up in the middle of the night, it's not because he has to go pee, it's because he has to reassure him he's not alone. He's home with my husband, uh, so dad is his dad. Okay. <laughs> We're playing tug, three-way tug. <laughs> he will. I just need him to be more aware because he's a big kid and I don't want him to roll over on him. My uh, Molly actually slept in our bed for years and actually as she's got actually, older, actually, I've learned how to uh, stay still on spot with the uh, Molly on. Yeah, but she does, she's actually in the last maybe year and a half decided she doesn't like to sleep on our bed anymore. I think she gets too hot. Usually, so she's, she she sleeps. The tile I, no, she like sleeps that. on my on his bed. In his room, because he's not in it anymore, because he lives up north now. <laughs> but usually she's the one that suffocates us. Yeah, she sits like right on top of him. But no, we're, as he gets older and he's reliably uh, house trained and stuff, uh, I expect he'll be coming in bed. <laughs> yeah, no, there's a no, the babies. Perfect. Remember, so with the Havanese, you haven't seen their tools already, so number one tool for grooming a Havanese is a pin brush. Yep. Uh, we actually have a we have, we, yeah, we have a pin brush and then the soft one on the other side. So Yeah, so pin brush, either long tines, short tines, doesn't matter. Yeah, no balls. Yep. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, with the Havanese, you brush first and then you comb. And the comb, you have to have a straight comb, a yep. metal comb of some kind. Okay. Um, the it finer is, it is, the better it is. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. If you, Percy. you may, the comb, the brush might go over knots, but the comb yeah, the is comb. soft. And that's we. And then stop and pull the knots yeah. apart. Don't yank the comb. No, no. Yeah. Oh, no, baby. Again, we do that with uh, her with the cop too as well because she's. Go say hi. I brush her. Yeah. And her long tail. Yeah. <laughs> um, Tell so There's three pages here on grooming. Okay. Just covered base and stuff. And again. Uh, if you go online, I give you a page to her okay. watching the dog start for uh, 20 years, yeah. so it's up there. Uh, okay. So the, you, you can read this. You know, yeah, yeah, we'll read it. Yeah. Well, I think we'll read it this weekend with it. Oh, yeah. 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 Look at you guys. What are you so doing here? Yeah. Work. yeah. So are we. I've lost oh, my puppy. Oh, okay. So this dog is not going anywhere. 